What's up everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to this commentary playthrough of Crash Bandicoot 4. This is probably going to be the last level of the game other than the final boss battle. So without much further ado, let's get into it. It's clearly going to be one of the hardest ones. Let's see how we do. And yes, it's looking like a massive throwback to the first Crash Bandicoot game. Cortex Castle, let's get into it. I remember them kind of corridors well. I'm trying to remember, was the Crash Bandicoot 1 level called Cortex Castle as well? I think it might have been. Okay, here we go. Oh god. I mean, the first checkpoint is literally right there, so I feel like already it's going to be... This castle is a maze. I alone know all of its secret halls and passages. Like the one behind the portrait of Grandfather that opens when you press on his triangular fossa. Hmm. But how? <laughs> but yeah, that checkpoint being right there is, I think, an indicator that surely even getting to the first one is not going to be easy. Here we go. Okay, fine. Maybe it wasn't so bad. So he's told us there's a secret path with the portrait of his grandfather. Fine. Yeah, that one goes all the way up. Just thinking, is there something above it though? Is there a reason for that? Yes, okay, there we go. There's no reason for this to go that high. Whoops, gotta be excited. So I'm sticking with the analog stick for now. I think I will make the analog stick like my, oh for God's sake, I'll make the analog stick my Crash 4 kind of default. So after over 20 years of playing Crash, I think it's time to, it's time to transition. Because the extra accuracy that's needed in this game compared to like the first... Oh shit. The extra accuracy that's needed in this game compared to the first three is... It definitely makes sense to have it. A lot of intricate jumping stuff here already to start. Like even this one's going to be hard. Okay. Here we go. Oh, I got stuck in between the two of them, man. Okay. It's not that difficult. It really isn't. I just... Um, I got a bit twitchy to make sure I made the thing in time. Yeah. When the margins are, are so tight, it kind of forces you the other way. You try to be too quick sometimes, and that causes you to screw up even more. So some of these, you really have a nice big window of time to get things done, but you get your head in like a, I have to do everything super rapid kind of state, and that causes even more mistakes. But hey, this is Cortex Castle, man. Gotta nail this bit. Okay, well that's something. Yeah, that's too far from everything else, so I think I've gotta I've gotta come down to that one from above. I think that's probably the easiest way. Yeah, as soon as I died once or twice on this one. It's not too difficult, like it's not extreme, but I knew I was going to probably need a mask. Especially for those two boxes. Okay. Here we go. It's going to work this time. Oof. 
Right, so now I have this one that I've got to jump down to. Ugh. Again, because another jump blade one, I'll probably... Alright, good. Now I can finish this bit in peace. Sweet, okay. So we did the first section. Five deaths. This is another depth perception one where obviously my instinct is to completely run over it, but oh yeah, we can do that. Sorry, I, for I forgot it was this type. Okay, good. Hmm. I feel like this one then places where maybe like you can jump onto the sides or some shit. It feels like there could be a lot of stuff hidden around corners. Yeah, okay, there you go. Yeah, getting 170 box is gonna be a tall order for this one. Okay. have to land on it. I was thinking, can you make it without landing on it, but it doesn't seem like the case. Okay. Did I miss this one last time as well? There you go. Ah. They completely overlap each other, so it's very difficult. I don't know if I've got enough to get both. There you go. I guess I did. Oof. Right. Oof. It's getting harder still. Again, a lot of little corners. Oh, it bounces around. Okay. Yeah, that was a good... Okay, good. Hanging in there. I feel like I'm going to miss that grandpa portrait because I'm just focusing so hard on not dying. But the bonus level came pretty early on this one. 39. Oh god, I hate these. Okay, I think I can I think I can jump back. I thought I had to do something really difficult there, but I don't think so. Not for the start. Wow, what is that? It's very rare you actually get an enemy in a bonus round. I can't recall the last time I saw that. That's really weird. That's super weird. Okay. Right. I think I have everything. Now I just need to be able to jump back here. Good. Ooh. That one feels a bit tough. <laughs> yeah, 
Yeah, sacrifice the Wumper on that one. Um, okay. Uh, right, I need to get the box first. More exclamation marks below. Oh, you can slide between them. Come on. Ugh. I thought they were enough in sync that you couldn't get between the, the crates and kill yourself, but I was making progress. Just trying to figure out how to how to best tackle this bit. I mean, I want to get those two boxes up there. And then I want to get the two boxes up there and then come back up to this ledge. Yeah, that's the worst, worst timing. I feel like that bit's going to be super hard. I've been having a fair few goes at this. I feel like this might be one of those ones where rather than take 45 minutes on a bonus level, I might have to give it up. It's been about 10 minutes so far, and every time there's so many little things that can go wrong, it's like one of them always goes wrong. And on the 10% of attempts where it doesn't, then you have to get to that difficult bit and try and make a decision of how exactly to execute that. Okay, so this is a strange variation of events, which I don't think is going to really help me here, but um, I was supposed to make it back to the platform, but it was still electrified, so I didn't feel like I had much of a choice. Uh, I don't think there's a way back from here. I mean, this is a bit of a weird situation here. I'm pretty certain there's no way back for me to get to that bit. Yeah, I won't be able to jump high enough. In terms of this bonus round, I've been I've been defeated by it. Like this early stuff, I can do. I've got it down. Obviously, I've been doing it for like ten minutes now. Um, only problem is, once I get near the end of it, I just cannot. I can't decide how to tackle it in the in the best way. So, like, hold on. Let's just do this bit too. Yeah, like this part of it is all fine. But once I get here, I just I, I just don't know what to do next. There's too much to do. Like, if I go down to the bottom bit, then I really struggle. And if I try to basically get these two uh, Wumper boxes and then come back the other way, I still fail. So I'm not really seeing how I can manage it. So I'm just going to probably give up here and just try and get to the finish. Because like, even all of this stuff is just it's tough. So for some reason you can't slide off this one. Okay, you can. Oh wow, I actually did it. Whoa, that was the time where I gave up. <laughs> okay, there we go. Yay, we're still in business. Dan's go away, it's still in business, my friends. I'd given that about 15 minutes and I was really like getting ready to just say, you know what, I don't think I can do that bit. But there you go, sometimes it just works. No, that was already a bad start. Oof. 
yeah. There's a reason why there's that checkpoint literally right there. Because <laughs> they know there's going to be another bloody 10. I think we have to do a double stop here. Yeah, so I have to stop that one right, right where I need it. Ah! Am I sm did I just smack the TV there? Yeah, this time I went too early, but we'll get there. Uh, yeah. Agonize any close now. There you go. So you didn't have to do a double stop. Loud? Why I never? What, 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 what is it? Am I seeing double? Embryo, quickly! Revoke this broad's hologram access! Uh, uh, um, no, Embryo! I'm no fraud! I'm from the future! You must listen to me! Embryo, do you not recognize your own master? I'm the real Cortex! No, Embryo, I am! Ding dong, ding dong! Oh my, sounds like the doorbell! I'd better go see who it is! Oh boy. Okay, I, th I feel like that final boss battle is surely going to be like a double... A double Cortex boss battle. Oh, wow. This should be fun. Okay, nice. <laughs> Is it going to replay that thing every time? Okay, really got to jump high with this one. Push him into the nitros. No? Fine. I do wonder if one of these is like it leads down to a lower path or something, but right now I'm just gonna. Ah, that bit's gonna be tough. Maybe I should go back once I get to the end. Hold on, I think I have a better way of doing that. Also a better way of doing that. Hmm. Yeah, so that's the problem with that. Well, I think that means there's kind of... It's very rare that this game puts barriers on you being able to actually do something, but... I think this time... Ooh, okay, just about. Oof. Any trouble is I'd have to do that every time. That's a continuation of the level. Hmm. Well, that ain't good. Uh, they want me to kind of hold on. Let me practice this. I'd have to go around, do this, and then fall back like that. I'd have to kind of loop. But that's like a one-time platform. Usually, these platforms come back given enough time. Yeah. But. So this is not going to be easy. Yeah, there's really not a lot of... 
The only trouble is that I've got to do this bit first every time. If I want to keep the, the chances of getting all the boxes alive. This is not good. This is not good. Wow. That was already difficult enough as it is. Wow. That's so tough. At least I have a mask here, which I'm hoping will help. Just practice my... <laughs> Alright, here we go. This is it. Oof. Damn you, game. <laughs> that is tough. That is tough. Right. I'd love another checkpoint right about now, <laughs> please. Oh man, I thought the invincibility after the mask would last a little bit of time, but this section is so horrible just because of how long it's going to take. Oh man, I'm demotivated now because I just know that even nailing what I nailed in the previous run was just so difficult that I don't feel like I can do it again. These ones, because they're you have a lot of space, it's not quite so bad. What happens to the mask, though? I still contend that that's one of the shittest things about this game. There's, there's just too many situations where there's no good reason for the mask to not be able to save you in that situation. I really can't think of a reason why it shouldn't be able to save you. It's stupid. They're just laser beams. You should hit the laser beam the mask should go, you'd be invincible for half a second, then you carry on. I really don't see why you would have to lose everything. To me, it's stupid, but... Sure, there's always people that will disagree. No, it's a great mechanic. It makes it more challenging, yes? See, look, that one's fine. Oh, wait, I've got a double mask? Shit. I shouldn't have spazzed around. I didn't realise. So I guess the only thing I can think of is, but I'd already flipped... I guess maybe because I already had upwards momentum. Yeah, this was always going to be a double mask section anyway. Okay. Ah, they put a checkpoint in the middle. Thank you very much. Thank you, game. It's definitely what I needed. Oh, horrible timing. I guess I could kind of ride the middle one, but... Keep going. Yeah, that bit is so hard. That bit is so hard. It's got to be one of the most technically challenging parts of the entire game. Is there a reason you can't ride these? That would have been fun. Like, if that was a cheat way to actually get through the level.
Yeah, so if I was kind of facing the other way, then it would have worked, but for this one, I'm just going to... I'm not going to try too hard to kind of be all methodical about it. I'm just going to rack up the death and probably get like a double mask to... to just make my life easier. Though I do think at least to start... There you go, there's my double mask. I should start from this side. Yeah, you see, even a double mask just gets wiped out. You have to be really quick with that bit. Your masks don't help. So I still contend what I, with what I say, where, like, if your mask... There's too many situations where your masks don't help. It's dumb. And again, it stops the game from feeling fair. I mean, I would say a, a huge majority of the game has been fair in terms of his difficulty. I wouldn't say it's an unfair game difficulty-wise, but there have been some bits here and there where I'm like, nah, that's just, that's just unfair. One of the times I noticed it most was... Um, was with the crates in the jet ski bit. Like, the, the hitboxes for those crates was literally just wrong. Like, you, you saw multiple examples of where the crate should have popped, and it didn't. So, like, that was a, a great example. Another one is, like, examples of where the mask should save you, but it doesn't. Finally did that bit. So there's not too many of them, but when it does happen, it's definitely a pain in the ass. Whoa. Oh, there's one of these for this level? That's interesting. I didn't know that. Okay. Quit struggling! Don't make me help anyone! We have an evil doppelganger situation! I'm not a doppelganger! I'm... No, forget it. Help! There, that'll shut me up. Here we go again. I was trying to look ahead there. I was just... Oh, no. I'm trying to think what happens. Oh, I can use the barrier. So hold on. So I jump safely onto this, and then I go back up. I want to block it. So then, I, yeah, I've got to jump. Jump and do it at that point, I think. So let's try. But then again, no. Yeah, I've got to do some weird shit like that. Maybe I, I can just completely jump around it. Yeah, that was smart. Smart. Let me give this another go. I'm literally going to try and jump around these beams instead of doing anything fancy. Oh, get out. Yeah. So that was the right idea. I'm pretty sure that that mask can protect you from the beams. I doubt you die when you're spinning on that mask. Huh? Oh no, <laughs> it's one of those sections! Okay, well, 50 deaths coming up now. So all the masks are going to be quickly used back to back and you just got to think fast. And do your best to try and keep up. Oh come on, that's the first time I did that particular mistake. There's always room for new mistakes. I swear, if I hit this top bit again, I'm going to be pissed off. There you go. They put a checkpoint there this time. I mean, because there's a checkpoint there, should I investigate? Yeah, 
idea. I just wanted to see if there was anything up there. I sacrificed a life because I have this anyway. You've got to be very quick with the first one. <laughs> uh, this is going to be some quick fire deaths now. Okay. So you've got to be sort of... You've got to be quick on the first one, but not so quick on the second. I went too quick. Racking them up. Racking them up, racking them up. Racking them up. This is just asshole territory. Imagine trying to do this on like a perfect relic run or a time trial. You'd be absolutely fooked. Yeah, there you go. That was some skills right there. Skills to pay their bills. Oh, get out of town. Seriously. This is the final this is the final thing, man. This is the game's final way of saying I hope you had fun dying. Here's a few more deaths just for your trouble, you know. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I mean, this is this is quite literally the kitchen sink, so you can't do it like that. I tried to see if that was possible. Oh, come on. Come on now. He dropped like a stone. He dropped like an absolute stone. Oh, how am I supposed to get that high one? Wait a minute. Okay, so that's what I wanted to do. So calm the hell down for a second. Yeah, I panicked when I saw it come back again, but I've got a better I've got a better idea now. I can do this. Ah, uh, I thought maybe that was the trick. Maybe it still is. Hold on. I think it might still be. I think that's what I've got to do. Okay. That's how I get it. Then I just need to. Then I just need to spin back to the previous one. I thought I was at the end, but they're not giving you any more boxes here, so... <laughs> Fuck you. Oh, well, that, that's funny. Hmm. So just relentless... I tried to see if I could go around it. I thought, since I've got that little thing going on anyway. I think this might have to be the level where I really just... I forget about this whole thing. It's going to be too hard, I think. I'm just going to have to try and get to the end here. Huh. Yeah, I don't think I understand how to get those. Come on, let me... The way it just let me get stuck in between those boxes was horrible. They are just horrible. Yeah, well, so now you know how to get through that bit. That's good to know. I think I have a handle on this now. Okay, 
fine. It's all just a single checkpoint, and that was the finale. Hmm. I'm not really sure how I'm going to deal with that. I'm really not sure how to do that. I'm really not sure you drop, you drop too much for it, so... I'm not really sure. I, I think next time I'm going to take a more of a pause there. Up to 90. Ah, I think that was the final thing. Okay. All right, I've got it now. <laughs> Look at the flashback tape, by the way. Expecting you to have come here without any deaths. That's quite, that's kind of funny. Um, I don't think the slowing down of time matters here. I shouldn't bother with that. I think. Because I think once I switch the mask, it's already gone. So... Uh, 97! Got a better idea now, though. A boo bird a bar indeed. I'll be there soon. Might not be in, a, in under a hundred deaths, but Way. My friends, I think this sums up the game, doesn't it? Final level, all those trials and tribulations and 98 deaths are still kept under 100, but 169 boxes. That just sums it up. There's not much I can say about that. Again, it's Cortex Castle. I'll give it a pass, but I think that's happened to me maybe four times now, five times. But in editing, I will check to see if it was genuinely just like me being shit and there was a box that I missed that was in view, or was it a really sneakily hidden box that they were assholes with to, to stop you from getting the box gem. But there you go, 98 deaths. Not a single level with over 100. I'm proud of that. Which is something I never thought I'd say for a Crash game, but you guys have seen. It is what it is. So that leaves the final boss, and it's going to combine all the all the bloody masks again, probably. So it's going to be a nightmare. 